Hello everyone. In this video, we are solve a nice mass Olympiad question. This question is a plus b is equal to six. And a v is equal to six. We are find out what is the value of a and v in this mass problem. So this is our first equation. We are called this is second equation. Now, here first equation, it will be a plus v is equal to six. Now you can see easily this expression here, v is equal to 6 minus a. This is our third equation. I just move on this a in this side, it will be negative a. Now at this moment, I can see easily our second equation, it will be a v is equal to 6. Now we know that here is v is equal to 6 minus a. So I put this value in this equation. So it will be a times 6 minus a is equal to 6. I just put on this value in this equation. Now at this moment you can see easily this a times this 6 it will be 6a minus a times a e to v a square minus 6. Now I can see this expression it will be minus a square plus 6a and if I move on this value in this side, it will be negative 6 is equal to 0. Now, at this moment, if I multiply both sides negative 1, so it will be positive a square minus 6a plus 6 is equal to 0. Because of that, minus minus it will be plus, plus minus it will be minus, minus minus it will be plus, and 0 times something it will be 0. It's okay. Now we'll find out here is a nice quadratic equation. This equation it will be s squared minus 6a plus 6a is equal to 0. So here is a is equal to 1. So you can see easily here is a, it will be minus b plus minus square root v square minus 4ac over 2a. So according to this law, I can see easily here is a is equal to minus b minus and v is negative 6 and plus minus square root v square I mean negative 6 square minus 4 a c a is 1 and c is 6 over 2 a a is 1. Now you can see easily here is 6 minus minus it will be plus 6 minus minus and here is positive 6 and this is plus minus square root and it will be 6 square we know that 6 square it will be 36 but there here is minus so minus 6 square it will be positive 36 because of that here is even number power is even number it will be 2 now at this moment you can see easily here is 4 times 6 it will be 24 over 2 now i can see easily here is 6 and this is plus minus and square root look 36 minus 24 it will be 12 now i can see easily here is 2 then this 12 it will be 6 plus minus square root 12 it will be uh, 4 times 3 over 2 now you can see easily here is 6 plus minus square root 4 it will be 2 and here is square root 3 over 2 then this 6 divide this 2 it will be 3 i separate this fraction this 2 divide this 2 it will be 1 and we will find out here is plus minus square root 3 so we'll find out here is a is equal to a1 it will be 3 plus square root 3 and a2 it will be 3 minus square root 3. It's okay. Now, at this moment, we'll find out b is equal to what? But recall our third equation, uh, it will be b is equal to 6 minus a. So I put this below in this equation. So our third equation, it will be b is equal to 6 minus a this is our third equation now i put this below in this equation so i can see that here is v is equal to 6 minus a it will be 3 plus square root 3 then in this expression you can see easily v is equal to 6 minus and it will be 3 plus sorry minus square root 3 now at this moment you can see that here is v is equal to 6 minus 3 
minus square root 3 and here v is equal to 6 minus 3 plus square root 3 minus minus it will be plus now at this moment b is equal to 6 minus 3 to be 3 minus square root 3 and here is v is equal to 6 minus 3 to be 3 plus square root 3 this is square root 3 so we are find out when a is equal to this is the value of a and v when a is equal to 3 plus square root 3 this time b is equal to 3 minus square root 3 and again when a is equal to 3 minus 3 minus square root 3 this time you can see easily here is b is equal to 3 plus square root 3 now at this moment you can see easily our final answer a and b it will be 3 plus square root 3 and 3 minus square root 3 and 3 minus square root 3 3 plus square root 3 now let's check out our question it will be a plus v it will be 6 and a v is equal to 6 this is our question let's verify first of all i add a and v it will be 6 so here our a it will be 3 plus square root 3 and v it will be 3 minus square root 3 so at this moment here is 6 so at this moment you can see really this this cancel out this is positive this is negative so 3 plus 3 it is always 6 so left hand side and right hand side is equal but our other equation a v is equal to 6 now a and v it will be 6 okay so our a it will be 3 plus square root 3 times b it will be 3 minus square root 3 is equal to 6 now at this moment we know that it will be a plus b times a minus b it will be a square minus v square so you can see easily it will be 3 square a it, it will be 3 minus v square b it will be square root 3 whole square is equal to 6 now at this moment 3 square will be 9 minus square root cancel it will be 3 is equal to 6 so 9 minus 3 it will be 6 is equal to 6 so you can see easily left hand side and right hand side is equal so our final answer in this mass olympiad question it will be a v this and this thank you all if you enjoyed this video please subscribe my channel for other interesting video goodbye take care